What is going on, everybody? It's Phil Cape with NMS Gaming. No Money Spent Gaming here. We are back with MLB The Show 21 Diamond Dynasty. In today's video, I want to do a little tutorial on exactly how the marketplace works, um, understanding it, and then how to make stubs in the process of all that. So first off, let's just go to the marketplace. As you see here, this is on PlayStation. The menu might be a little bit different on Xbox. Um, but you can just R1 and L1, go over to the shop, and then you go over to Marketplace. And then there's different tabs here, MLB players, equipment and perks, sponsorships. Um, those are your orders, stadiums, and unlockables. Um, we're going to start off with um, players. These are probably some of the more common flip things. Um, obviously, you're not going to be able to do these diamonds. So you can try to look at golds and other things. But first off, uh, you know, we're just going to go down here a little bit um, for people that don't have a lot of coin or for stubs, I should say. Sorry, I'm used to playing Madden. Um, so let's go down here to the silvers. They're a little bit cheaper. And then we'll show you exactly how you would buy or then sell a card as well. Okay, so we're down here at the silvers. Um, so it's fine. This is a good one here to show. So we'll click on him. You want to go to buy sell options so you have a buy and a sell tab over here and you see the prices are lined up under them directly so what you want to do is you want to click buy if you want to buy this card to flip it so we want to buy it for 391 you want to buy it for the sell price on the right and then you want to sell it so say you you know you bought that card for 390 then you would sell it for the buy price, the 628. So, you know, you do that. You would type in 389, and we'll check that out. We'll show that for you there. It's been given a little lag there. Um, boom, see the 389 is over here. So I bought it, I'm putting in an order to buy one at 389. So when somebody gets that card, they're going to quick sell it, and then I'll get it for that 389 and then I can then sell it. I don't have one to sell, but then I would type in 628 and I would sell that card. So that's what you're looking for. You're going to have to remember your minus your 10% on all the things, but you just find like this. There's a big gap here, 4000 to 2000 You know, you could buy that card for 1900 and then sell it for 4000 You know, that's a good amount of stubs to make, 1000 2000 stubs. You know, those are the kind of things you're looking for. But again, you know, if you only have a few hundred stubs, a few thousand stubs, you know, find some of these silver players, um, things like that, and uh, work your stubs up to, you know, bigger and bigger cards. Um, if you guys need any more um, complex breakdown other than that, um, you know, obviously you guys can, um, you know, try out some equipment, um, but the equipment is pretty expensive. Again, you're going to have to work up to some of that. Same with the sponsorships, they're pretty expensive, so, you know, I would start with the players, some of the silver players and things like that, and kind of work up your stubs. You see these are, you know, they're getting a little expensive if you don't have a lot. But if you guys have any comments, uh, concerns, definitely type them down in the comment section below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Make sure you guys do hit the like button on the video, it greatly helps me out, support the channel. Make sure you guys do hit the sub button as well. Appreciate you guys taking the time to watch the video. I'm out of here.